what is up humanoid nation so today's video i'm gonna be reacting to is by the channel him indoors and the title is him indoors short film starring reese shearsmith and pollyanna mcintosh all right let's get this horror thing out of the way let's do this Ragnar oh no oh wait our agoraphobia okay i have nothing to worry about open or public place but i said arachnophobia i was gonna quit right there and now him indoors he calls himself a landlord that Jesse Simmons was ever dead pulling anything like this with Mother. She knew how to handle that swine. Three days. Three days and he sends me out there. He knows I can't go out there. I like it in here. Safe in here. Parasites out there. Horrible, stinking, putrid people that live to drink their beer and copulate with each other. When you go out there, bad things happen. I mean, you understand me, don't you? I mean, you wouldn't be tied to a chair right now if you stayed indoors. What? Oh, this got dark real quick. Because you're wondering where you fit into all this exactly. Well, you're lucky, really. I used to do this for fun back in the day. I am people to chairs? Help you bring people back for me. She's always very proud of the fact I had a hobby. Every young boy should have a hobby, she'd say. This is different, you're, uh, you're serving a much greater purpose. There's a girl next door, you see. She just moved in. Pretty little thing she is. Divorcee. She popped round to say hello the other day, and before I knew it, <laughs> I'd invited her around for a meal tomorrow night. I must say, I had intended to cook us an Italian. <laughs> An actual Italian or Italian food. It looks like we're having Indian instead. <laughs> okay, Hannibal Lecter. Oh, oh shit. <clears throat> Put the helmet back on. <laughs> Elizabeth, is that you? Lizzie, silly. Uh, oh, yes. Uh, well, look, uh, give me uh, just a sec. I've, I've built some uh, red wine and I've, I've got to get it now or else it'll stay. Now, stay there. Red, red, fire. This dude has balls, though. Going on a date while murdering some dude. He told you, he told you to wait. Can't wait? Jeez, people are rude. Oh, hello, dear. You're a day early. I'm sure we said Friday. No, no, you're right. You're right. We did say Friday. I was just, I was just hanging out next door, you know, having a beer and chucking some pictures up. And um, I realized I was banging away on your wall. What a cow. So I thought I'd just check if I wasn't disturbing you or anything. Oh, no. You know, you bang away. Okay. Just making sure. Hmm. You all uh, coming together through there? Is it um, unpacked and such? No, not not really. Kind of creeped out actually by how much stuff I have. You know, that and the whole bit lonely. <sighs> I probably just need a break. A nice cup of tea. That or a shag. 
Okay, I was gonna say she wanted to fuck, but she said it. Okay. Should I like a cup of tea? Murder one. Just really needs to get out, you know what I mean? Change of scene. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. Shoes off. Damn, she's oh, tall. Sorry. Hey. Nice boots. Yes, they're definitely mine. Awkward. Uh, if you'd like to uh, park yourself through there, the Thank living room. <laughs> so nice to be in a normal looking place. I'm really struggling to figure out where everything goes. It's my clothes that are taking forever. It's like outfits just laying about like dead bodies. Oh, that sounds uh, like hell, I'm sure. I've lived here since I was a kid, you see. I don't really remember uh, living in our old house. Uh, I'll, I'll pop the kettle on. Uh, do you take milk and sugar? Yeah, um, milk and one sugar. Oh. Are they in the room with the same body or what? Or not? Never mind. You had a lot of jobs then. Uh, oh no, no, they're uh, they're uh, souvenirs. Horror Appreciation Award for Best Article. Are you a writer then? Uh, yes, occasionally. Uh, um, online stuff mainly. Get in. God, I love a bloody good horror. I got scared shitless at the weekend. What was the last horror film you saw at the cinema? What you put in a drink, bro? Uh, that would be The Fly. Yes, 1986. I don't get out much. <laughs> Jeff Goldblum. You're a video shop lover. So am I actually. Yeah, I practically lived at the video shop when I was a kid. What the hell? What the hell is that? That's fucking odd. That's the most random statue I've ever seen. <laughs> what? Video shop lover. So am I actually. Yeah, I practically lived at the video shop when I was a kid. Yeah, me too when I was young. Uh, I learned a lot from nightmares in a damaged brain. Only joking. <laughs> Bro, I can't take this seriously with this fucking thing around. I know this is supposed to be a horror, but this is taking the edge out of it. I'm, this is too funny. <laughs> this is just too funny. I can't take this seriously. You're gonna have to keep a swift eye on you, aren't I, mister? That would probably be best. <laughs> <laughs> I can't stop looking at it. Fucking thing. Ah, yes. Uh, the Highness. It's ergonomic sofa. Uh, Mum. Uh, bless her. She had a really bad back. Ugh. Oh. Has she been gone long? Uh, yeah. Yeah, two years now. Um, still not really used to it. Um, she did so much for me. How did she go? Heart stopped. Oh, you mean uh, your yeah, cause of death? Oh, uh, damn. Eating fruit. Uh, food poisoning. Oh, God. Horrible. Yeah. Really horrible. Bro, pizza uh, hog popped behind her. God. What? What is it? It's just the uh, red wine I spilled. I've missed a bit, and uh, <laughs> you wait there, and I'll get something to uh, to deal with that. Red wine doesn't do that. Of course, she's gonna be curious. Dead, dead. Oh, yeah. No blood on the hammer, huh?
too early, Elizabeth. Far too early. Therefore, you deserve to die. Hello there. Yes, I'd like to report some murders, please. Who did them? I did. Gregory Brewster. It is the opinion of this oh, court he actually turned that himself show in. no remorse for your grisly actions towards Elizabeth Campbell, Kunal Sharma, and the 16 other individuals you proudly lay claim to have murdered 16, between huh? 1990 yeah. and 2009. Jesus I Christ. I sentence you to life imprisonment with the recommendation that you serve a whole life term. You will spend the remainder of your natural life behind locked doors and never set foot in the outside world again. Damn, that sucks. Take him down. All right, come on, you. Out to the exercise yard. Oh, he doesn't want to go outside. He was happy being inside his own cell. He had a smile. And then it got fucked up for him for going outside. Legally, aren't they supposed to have, like, at least one hour of going outside for anybody? Oh. Yeah, look at this guy. Behind locked doors and He's never happy. set foot in the outside world again. Take him down. Happy. All right, come on, you. Out to the exercise yard. Yep. Fuck you. Yeah. How is it like? Yeah, he wanted to be. All right. Pretty interesting movie itself. What is it like in real life if you're a solid? Are you not allowed like one hour of rec time outside for anything? Because that they can't put you. I don't know. Someone tell me. That be that's that's all I know. Maybe I'm wrong. How does it work in London? Anyway, it's a really good movie. Really good movie. That statue though is like oh geez, it took me out of it. Always, that's it for now. Human Nation, Human Way Freak Out. Bye. Pasito a pasito, suave, suavecito. Nos vamos pegando poquito a poquito. Cuando tú me ves.